A map tells us the exact location of different places in our city. On a larger scale, a world map tells us the location of cities, countries, continents and oceans in the world. A map can be defined as a graphical representation of the Earth's surface drawn to a scale on a sheet of paper. There are different types of maps that serve different purposes. Political maps show the boundaries and the location of countries, states and cities. Physical maps show the physical features such as mountains, plateaus, plains and seas. Thematic maps give various details, some of which are as follows. Climatic maps show climatic conditions such as rainfall, temperature and wind pressure of a place. Natural vegetation maps show forests, grasslands and crops grown in a region. Transport maps show roads, railways, sea routes and airline routes. Natural resources maps shows the minerals and other natural resources found in a place. Factors in map making. The important factors in map making are directions, scale, colors and symbols and signs. Directions. All maps follow a uniform method of indicating directions. North, south, east and west are the cardinal points of a map. The top portion of the map represents north. South is to the bottom, east is to the right, and west is to the left. Most maps indicate the north with an arrowhead. The directions between the cardinal points are northeast, northwest, southwest, and southeast. These are the subdirections. Scale A map is much smaller than the actual size of the area it represents. The scale of a map is the ratio between the distance of two points on the ground and their corresponding distance shown on the map. Colors Standard colors are used in maps to show the physical features of an area. Water bodies are shown in blue. Deep waters are shown in dark blue and light blue indicates shallow waters. Mountains and highlands are shown in brown. High mountains in dark brown and lower mountains in light brown. Plateaus are shown in light brown, a lighter shade of brown compared to lower mountains. Plains and lowlands are shown in green. Deserts are shown in light yellow. Symbols and Signs Standard signs and symbols are used in maps to indicate specific features. These standard symbols are called conventional symbols. A globe is a spherical model of the Earth. It has the map drawn on it and is mounted on an axle so that it can be rotated.